The topic for presentation is characteristics of order mets carriers. Introduction part. The systematic position of this order of bryophytes according to Suster 1953 and 58 kingdom is plantae, division bryophyta, class hepaticopsida, subclass jungermani and order mets carriers. It has about 25 genera and 600 species. Botnis Muller in 1954 recognized six families, but Suster in 1966 listed eight families. The important families of this order are Peleaceae, Ricardiaceae, and so on. Some botanists separate the family Tribiaceae that has two genera into the segregate order Tribules on the basis of several unusual morphological features of the gametophyte. Here I have included some pictures of this genera of order Metzgerials like Palea, Blasia, Ricardia, Cryptothallus, etc. Moving on to the distribution part. They are widespread in distribution and occurs in temperate and tropical regions of the world. They are entirely restricted to regions with high humidity or readily available moisture. There are about 10 genera in India which are found in Himalayas and South Indian regions. These spe species are hygrophytic that are they are adapted to grow in aquatic environments and mesophytic which are those that survive in an environment with little liquid water. Combination of shade and abundant moisture is a precondition for successful growth. They grow on damp soil, moist rocks and bark of trees. The oldest fossil is Pelvicinized Devonicus from Upper Devonian Rocks. The characteristic features of this odor. The thallus is of diversified form. The first one is thalloid form that shows wavy margin and dichotomous branching. Example, Palea, Ricardia, Pelvicinia. The second one is leafy form in which the gametophyte is differentiated into stem and lateral leaves. The third one is transitional form, which is intermediate between thallos and leafy forms. And therefore, the members of this order are commonly called multiform thallohepatics. These are simple thalloids and show a very little histological differentiation. Mostly gametophytes are without internal differentiation of the tissues. But certain genera have central strand of thick wall cells. The ventral surface of this order bears smooth walled rhizoids. The sex organs occur in single or group on the dorsal surface of the thallus or on short ventral side of the branches. The archegonia do not develop from apical cells. It arises from the young segments cut off by the apical cells and hence it is an acrokinus. The thallus continues to grow. As a result, Argonia and sporophytes are dorsal in position. The capsule wall is 2 to 5 layers of cell thick. Capsule has elators. Comprises a much larger number of liverworts. Section through gametophyte showing the sex organs in Palea. The Archegonium, female sex organ. Anthridium, male sex organ. Involucre, the protective covering, and the growing tip. Key anatomical features they lack like air chambers, they lack like scales, gametangia is a side that is no stockage there, the seta elevates capsule above the thallus. Upper epidermis has no air pores. Abundance of chloroplast is seen in the upper layers of midrib and wings. Cells contain starch and some contains oil. Reproduction. They reproduce vegetatively by the formation of gemma, the bud-like structures which are variable in form and size. The gemma are produced inside the cup-shaped gemma cups on the dorsal surface of thallus. The second type of vegetative reproduction is fragmentation that is death and decay of older portion of thallus which is common in palea. The characteristic features of this odor. The thallus is of diversified form. The first one is thalloid form that shows wavy margin and dichotomous branching. Example, Palea, Ricardia, Pelvicinia. The second one is leafy form in which the gametophyte is differentiated into stem and lateral leaves. 
The third one is transition. Sexual reproduction. The plants may be monoecious or dioecious on the basis of presence of sex organs. Male reproductive and thridia are produced on the dorsal surface of mound-like projection called perigonia and the female reproductive organ known as artigonia are also present on the dorsal surface but they are covered by an involucular flap. Other protective outgrowths are also present such as perichetal scales, pseudoperianth. A calyptra also develops from the archegonia after syngamy. The sporophyte is differentiated into three parts. The first one is absorbing and anchoring swallowing base food. The second one is a long stalk like seta. And the third one is terminal sac like capsule that contains spores and elators. Here are some references. Thank you for watching.